Tonight, can vaping kill you? Good evening, Smoke Cartel. I'm Lester Holt's friend. Tonight, can vaping kill you? It's a question on everyone's mom's mind. This September, lungs were ablaze as the FDA reported that there had been 530 lung-related illnesses and eight deaths contributed to a various variety of vaping brands. But how could that be when Chad at the vape shop said it was fine? Chad lied, as usual. E-cigarettes have now become completely banned in states like Michigan, New York, and pretty soon the entire country. Many of the cases reported that they had used THC wax cartridges, but no one single brand could be contributed to all of them. THC vape cartridges are cannabis in a concentrated form known as dabs. Many cartridges discovered to be harmful are often marketed on social media illegally like Snapchat, YouTube, and Instagram. One case, 20-year-old Taylor Friedet reported using a dab pen she bought from her local dealer. While it worked wonders for her anxiety, depression, and suicidal thoughts, shortly after the vape's hardware fell apart and she became ill, beginning in stomach pain and nausea and eventually becoming acute pneumonia. She was put on a ventilator for five days. But why? The word of the day is vitamin E acetate. People want thick, high-quality THC oil, but most people don't have that. Vitamin E acetate became a popular thickening solution with little regard to safety and with very little understanding of what it actually was at all. But that's also how people do everything they ever do in their entire lives. Several companies offer bulk thickening agents on eBay like vitamin E, acetate, and several other unknown ingredients. Andrew Jones, a manufacturer of these thickening agents, estimates that vitamin C acetate is contained in 60 to 70% of dab cartridges across the board. While vitamin E acetate has become key in the investigation, experts warn that it is only the tip of the iceberg. So what does that mean for you, the consumer? It means it is wise to stay away from black market vape cartridges, always go through a reputable source that is compliant and transparent with current regulatory procedures. All this weird shit is being mixed in by sketchy dudes who want to make a quick buck selling death syrup. Luckily, reputable vendors like Smoke Cartel do not sell death syrup. Never buy cartridges or really anything else you put in your body from illegal online black market vendors. Be safe out there. No high is worth your lungs or your life. <laughs> We got reputable and vetted sources for the content in this video, but it is intended for general information, not for any legal, medical, or scientific advice.